I'm turning, in case you're wondering, I'm asking the official Obama criticizer uh, to determine for me whether these are uh, light-skinned Negroes that we're talking about here. Uh, and the official Obama criticizer is not light-skinned. We have screened, uh, uh, skinned. Uh, would you agree with that? Okay, okay. Oh, an official Obama criticizer is offended by Harry Reid's remarks. Right. Uh, because you are not light-skinned, is that why you're offended? Uh, let, let's, okay, let's, let's hear from the official Obama criticizer, uh, uh, Bo Snerdly. Uh, we got the technical set up to, uh, to do this. Are we ready to go? All right. He's uh, calling you. With the, what did you say he's calling you? I said, uh, Harry Reid, uh, sir, has officially, uh, in not so many words, called those of us that are not light-skinned darky Ebonics. And I don't appreciate that. You know, I mean, this is America. This is 2000. We're supposed to be in a post-racial, uh, harmonious yeah. environment. And here you have the Senate leader basically has put divided black people amongst themselves and said that some of us are better because of the light color of our skin and some of us are not good because we are dark, darkies. I don't appreciate it. Why, this is a throwback to Jim Crowism. The light skinned ones get to go in the room and drink out the fountains. You darkens, stay away. You're not allowed. I don't think this is appropriate. I think it's mean spirited. I don't understand Eric Holder saying that this is, well, he's light skinned, so I guess he gets a pass. I don't understand President Obama not standing up for us dark ones. What is this country coming to when us people of the sun? We dark people cannot be appreciated in the light of day by the light-skinned people. What has happened to America? And that is the official Obama criticizer. I admit I had not looked at it um, from, from that perspective. I, I had not looked at it from the perspective that Obama, by um, um, basically exonerating Harry Reid, had essentially thrown um, uh, dark-skinned... Uh, Negroes overboard. Well, I, 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 I really, I, I appreciate your perspective on that because I had not looked at it. You are personally, as an American, you're personally offended by this. As you, a dark-skinned right? American, and you feel left out. Yes, as a dark-skinned American. No, it's all, it's all. You know, it's uh, you. You feel thrown off the back of the bus. In other words, under the bus with Obama's grandmother. Under, under the back of the bus. Yes. Oh, um, uh, Bo Snirtley, the official Obama criticizer. A brief timeout while we all gather our thoughts here. Uh, uh, ladies and gentlemen, be right back. Doing the work that the mainstream American media just won't do.